do? We're gonna do some I, I genuinely don't know. It's recording. Is it? Five seconds. Okay. Hello. Hello. <laughs> Welcome to this vlog of ours. Ooh, Nina's first vlog. Oh my god, I'm a vlogger Whoa. now. <laughs> okay. So thank you guys for submitting all of your questions to the Ask Mad and Nina hashtag. We read through all of them. Yes. We wanted to answer all of them. We did. But then the video would be really long. So we're gonna pick a few to start with. <laughs> we'll, we'll do this again and then we'll be able to get the rest. Yeah. This is my best angle. Well, uh, yeah. By the way, is everybody seeing Mina's nails? She did those for the music video. Another one that we shot this weekend that I am barely, barely recovered from. Yeah, I slept in real late yesterday. Um, I don't sit. I don't sit as a director, and so my, my legs and my feet hurt. Mm -hmm. Okay, so first question from Mad Maddie Babies. I love you both so much. My question is from Machen. What inspired you to start directing? Um, well, this one right here, because she was in pre-production of a music video and things started falling apart. Falling apart. <laughs> she needed a director to step in and uh, David, my husband, me and his dad, suggested, well, your mom wouldn't even want to direct. You need a director, so you guys just work together. So Mina was like, Mom, I need you to direct. And I was like, all right, let's do this. <laughs> She nailed it. That was Kings and Queens. Kings and Queens, which yeah. and a handful of film festivals. Yeah, and, and won some awards. Yeah, not a bad start. I think she kind of caught the fever from there. Right. If, that's, if the, the shoulders are out, <laughs> might as well dust them off. Okay. Okay. From Serpent Ho. Serpent Ho. <laughs> I like we you. We had to answer that just because. I don't know what you name. asked, but hello. Ho, as in like a ho when you're working. TM. So it's branded. No one else is a serpent hoe. Maybe that's a weird question, but if you could be any animal, which one would it be and why? Black jaguar. You know, like, like Black Panther. <gasps> like Black Panther, like the movie Black Panther. I've always loved them. There you go. You um, know why? Because they lounge in trees in the jungle, and then when, when, when their prey walks underneath them, they just go And that's, that's what you want? Yeah, there's actually there's an animal trainer that explained it that mm. when people were like like they were scouting something and there was like a long line This is terrible. Right. <laughs> a long line of men and all of a sudden one disappeared. And she likes that <laughs> Okay, it was the panther. Well, they shouldn't be walking in the forest. That's their fault. What's Great. yours? Um, well, I would actually like to address <laughs> We'll address that at another time. I think that you you as an animal is an ostrich and I've always said that it's because she blinks at different time yeah, like that's... Anyway, for me, I would be a fish. Um, two, <laughs> two reasons. One, um, a lot of people reference me as the Angelina Jolie fish from Shark Tales. Why? They say that's what my face looks like. I think because my eyes are really far apart. I'll find it. Are your eyes really far apart? Let me see. I don't think they're far apart. They seem normal to me. And the other reason is, um, then I wouldn't be afraid of the ocean. Just like a win-win for you. Can you tell us a funny behind the scenes story? It doesn't say for what, so I guess just go for it with whatever project. Okay, I was sh shooting the sitcom Freddy, Freddy Prince Jr. Brian Austin Green was a cast member on there. We just all started playing pranks on each other. And I think the best one was when Brian put a bowl of water above the cracked door to my dressing room. Mm. But but I caught on. But I caught on. Yes, I opened the door. Yes, the, the bowl fell with water. But I had cat-like reflexes and I avoided getting wet. And I chased him down on the stage and seek to my revenge. That's great. Who is your favorite character from Riverdale? I am gonna say that my favorite character... Come on. <laughs> I mean, even if I wasn't your mother, Mama Coop is fun. You want her at every party. I'm gonna say either one of the Pussycats, just because... You wanna be one. Because I wanna be one. Tony Topaz. 
badass. And Alice Cooper because she's like a honey badger. She doesn't care. This is true. You should have said honey badger. Well, <clears throat> what's your favorite character other than Alice? Vegas, the dog. Mina, would you want to appear in Riverdale? <laughs> yes. From Asia, Jane 3. Fun fact, I've actually auditioned for a couple of characters in Riverdale. Can you, can you guess? Who? Am I allowed to? Why not? I auditioned for Tony Topaz. And... Oh no, the other ones are Sabrina. So for Riverdale, just Tony. So yeah. There you go. And I feel like you would have other illegitimate children out there. That's what's interesting. See, for them to cast you so close without an actual reference to you looking like me. Yeah. It's probably where it's tough. A little bit, a little bit of a challenge. It's but a tough situation. You know. You know. Alice gets Alice, around. She, she got around. She, nah, she still does. She stepped out on Hal.